My dear love, Kristen. Me, Dustin, standing on the beach on the grill, ready to take my bride, my Juliet, my best friend, my wife, on this long journey of marriage. I'm not afraid of losing what I found. If all the fallen pieces hit the ground. I see it in your eyes My lover and my bride My love's a steady tide Dear husband, I cannot put into words how much I love you. Even this book doesn't have enough pages to truly express how I feel. I never knew if this day would ever come for me. I never thought I was deserving of a love so pure and true and sure until I met you. I, Dustin Davidson. I, Kristen. Take you, Kristen. Take you, Dustin. To be my lawful wedded wife. Be my lawful wedded husband. I promise you, Kristen. I promise you, Dustin. In the presence of God. Our families and our friends. In the families and our friends. Always. Always. I'll be loving, faithful, and respectful husband to you. I'll be loving, faithful, and a respectful wife to you, for better and for worse. For richer and for poor, for sickness and health, Kristen, I love you and I cherish you. Dustin, I love you and I for cherish you. For as long as forever. This is my solemn vow. This guy over here was a marine fitness, like, pro. Could do the 30 pull-ups, could do the 50 sit-ups, it's killing me. Still can't. Yeah. Excuse me. Still can't. All right. Watch yourself. Tell me, watch yourself. Since then, you have been truly, like, really my best friend, a brother to me. You've allowed me to be inducted into the family. I share with your sister, your brother. We at work. I tell him, no, that's my brother at work. We at UPS. Make sure he gets his hours. That's my brother. But no, seriously, mom, you've been a mom to me. I never called you Miss Audrey. I've always called you mom. You've let me into your table. You fed me. You made this man mad. I would come over and have the chicken wings and meatballs. And you'd be like, yo, what's that a lot? Sorry, bro. I hate, that. I hate that shit too. So no, really, uh, I just thank you guys for allowing me to be a part of the family. Seriously, bro. Um, I even said it when you say, I want you to be the best man. I was like, no, man, it's definitely like, You're my brother too. And uh, I feel very honored to be able to be in this position, to have taken this role on. Seriously, man. Uh, one thing I'll say, and I'm going to shut up, y'all, is you've always been consistent, loyal, and dependent. I am so blessed to have such a thoughtful, compassionate, loving, caring, hardworking, God-fearing woman. And every day, I thank the Lord that I stumbled upon you, and you stumbled upon me. What more of you back me. <laughs> but I love that. I am so blessed to be with a woman like you. I love you with all my heart, with a passion that cannot be explained into words. It's something that I cherish so deeply. I promise to be faithful and honest to you and loving to you for the rest of my days. I promise to honor you and lift you up and make any type of goal reachable or obtainable as much as I can. When I say I do, that means I will, and I will forever. I will forever stand by your side through the good and bad. I will forever adore you being by my side when I'm good, I'm sick, or vice versa. I will always try to make you smile and laugh because when I see you, it just makes me so much happier. I would declare with all my heart to strive for happiness and success in this marriage. I promise to be your light in the dark, the warmth to your cold, your shoulder to lean on. I promise that you could just be behind my back whenever danger is in our way and I will take care of you. I'm so honored to be your husband. I waited over a year for this day. I remember we're on vacation and uh, we're going on a boat ride and Dustin said, I want to talk to you. And he said, um, you know, I've been with Kristen and I want to ask you to marry me, but I want your blessing before I go. And uh, I said, hey, yeah, you know, uh, and, uh, 
he went to the boat ride. He said he wasn't sure when, but during the boat ride, he said to me, this is a perfect song. And uh, I was trying to, to video it, but I ended up you know, panic and I hit the phone tip. So I'm thinking I'm, I'm videoing this thing and I messed up. But I want to say, you know, I'm a pro dad. And, and I've just, my daughter, which, you know, uh, I've watched, you know, um, a bird grow up and become a beautiful woman. You know, I'm very proud of you. You give me the security and love that is so certain I don't have to think twice. You are the yin to my yang, the salt to my pepper, the jack to my coke, and the bass to my drum. I remember the first kiss, touch, I love you, and so much more. And the feeling I get inside never changes. You make me feel like a little love crazed teenage girl and I cannot wait to spend eternity with you. I can't wait to build a family of dogs with you. <laughs> and if it's God's will, I can't wait to see the father that you will be to our children. I know you will be as devoted and loving and caring as your dad was. I wish he was physically here with us today, but I know he is looking down on you with the biggest smile and a heart full of love. I cannot wait to see what life has in store for us, but I just know it's gonna be beautiful. Being Mrs. Davidson, or becoming Mrs. Davidson, is my biggest flex yet, because I get you as my life partner. I call her my flower because she has always blossomed. Her parents planted seeds of greatness and she became an exquisite garden. She is rooted in love and care, bearing fruit of responsibility and loyalty. She has leaves of ambition, petals of perseverance, and she is resilient in storms. She is a woman who is more than deserving of all the love she has to give, and Dustin adores her. He shows love for the person she is, embracing her kindness, patience, and intelligence. He fell in love with her eyes and smile. She fell in love with his lips, embracing his humor, passion, and strength. Opposites attract, but they also complement, like night and day. He be the sun and she be the moon. He be morning and she be night. He be Mr. and she be Mrs. Always Right. True love ranks in a bouquet of roses. She is the garden, and now he is the fence around her to support and protect. They uplift each other, and unite creating a shared world, their own world, filled with roses, lilies, and bliss. God bless this black love and keep them in sweet matrimony.